Hi, race fans, and welcome to the Alltel Racing Report. Last month, Brian Newman and the Alltel team joined approximately 50 Cup teams for a two-day Cara Tomorrow test session at Talladega Super Speedway in preparation for this weekend's debut of the COT on a restrictor plate track. After seeing top speeds hit the mid-190s during the first day, NASCAR decided to use a slightly smaller restrictor plate, 31 30 seconds instead of a full one inch, in order to lower the speeds. On the final day of the test session with the new plate, Newman was 19th fastest with a lap of 191.390 in the number 12 Altel Dodge. After climbing out of the car, Newman said the slight decrease in speed was offset by the smoothness of Talladega's 2.66 mile trioval, which was repaved last year. So regardless of what restrictor plate package is used on Sunday, Newman said the COT should put on a good show for the fans. Uh, the track has plenty of grip in it still. It doesn't feel like the track has really lost much grip compared to when it was brand, brand new and paved and repaved. Um, the car itself, I don't know the exact downforce numbers. Uh, you know, we're running about the same speed, but it feels very comparable. It's just a matter of you know, the bumpers align up a lot better so you can push a lot harder. Um, and and uh, you know, it should be a lot of fun. It should be a great race. This Friday, we'll see two practice sessions in preparation for qualifying on Saturday and the race on Sunday. Be sure to check back with AllTellRacing.com for future AllTell team updates along with historical features.